Okay, so today I'm having trouble with the check engine light and I'm getting code number 0715. Um, as far as I know, code P0715 has to do with the transmission speed sensor. So I'm going to go get a transmission speed sensor, put it in, swap it out, show how I do that, and see if that solves the problem. So if for some reason you're having trouble with code P0715, then come along and let's see if we can't figure this out. Okay, this is the part that I need. This is what it looks like. Just a sensor, plug, two prongs, one bolt. And I just realized that I actually need two of these, not one. So there you go. Two transmission speed sensors. Okay, so here's transmission speed sensor number one near the rear of the transmission. And here is transmission speed sensor number two near the front of the transmission. So first I'm going to start by unplugging the sensor. Then I'm going to grab a 10 millimeter socket and take out the bolt. And then I'm going to pop out the sensor. So that's the old transmission speed sensor. And here is the new transmission speed sensor. Now the new sensor took a little bit of wiggling to get in, but once I got it lined up, I just grabbed the bolt, put it back in, and tighten her down. Now, fair warning to anybody who's dumb enough to try to copy me, um, I just hand tightened the bolt. I did not check the specs. Uh, I don't recommend anyone try to torque down a bolt on the side of a transmission like this without, you know, of course, checking the specs. But I'm me, and I don't care. So don't be like me. Um, but also, don't over-tighten the bolts. So that was the first sensor. I'm onto the second now. I unplugged it. I took out the bolt with a 10 millimeter, I'm grabbing the new one, putting it in, same old thing. Um, once again, this sensor, this transmission speed sensor was a little tight going in. I just twisted it and pushed down on it until it was flush with the surface, lined up the hole, and then put the bolt in. Um, again, I didn't over tighten it. I didn't check the spec, but I definitely recommend if somebody else tries to do this, that you check the specs or talk to your mechanic or, you know, all that safety stuff that uh, degenerates like me don't pay attention to. So, yeah, that's how to change the transmission speed sensor or two transmission speed sensors. Um, after I changed these out, I took it for a drive. The light went out. Haven't had any problems since. So I guess I did it right. Um, if you have this same problem yourself and you change the transmission speed sensor on your car let me know if you have any questions let me know um, either way you know give me a like subscribe all that good stuff and uh, maybe i'll make some more videos in the future so hopefully this helps somebody out and uh, i'll leave it there